Okay, campers, welcome to Metro RV and welcome to, well, I'm going to call it just about the big time. It's our first ever, uh, is it a Burma or Burma Grand Yamada uh, 24 foot? Uh, this van's got more options than any van we've ever had, which is a big statement because we've had thousands of vans. Uh, we'll start with simple things, a few simple things, simple people. Uh, I love pushing buttons and getting results. Uh, this van in a different league for all that sort of stuff. Uh, built seriously tough in Queensland. I don't know what they put in the water or the, the, the hotter or warmer air up there, but they just seem to do things in a different level. TV mounts, the van has a luxury of a full annex. These are little, I'll show you shortly, but it's uh, little clothes. Uh, And now, oh. not only does it have a uh, pretty decent barbecue, but it's got somewhere to put a few stubbies, which is uh, pretty handy. Uh, van's got uh, a diesel heater, storage. Now this is, this is not a lightweight van. This is a very serious caravan, and it's going to take a very serious camper to, to, to buy it. Now that is a McHitch, which uh, replaces your uh, conventional hitch. Now when you, uh, when you buy a McHitch, the, the first thing they ask you is would you like fries with that? But uh, uh, no, not very funny. You're not laughing, is he? Anyway, um, that's, now that probably gives you an idea of what's going on. This is your little clothesline that fits. We might as well do it today. Go. Uh, there's also a facility for it on the other end. Now, I love slapping a, a good strong chassis. Uh, this thing's built like nothing else. It is, it is without doubt one of the toughest vans we've had. The build quality of it is in a different dimension. Now, most people that are going to watch these are. Pretty, they're in the caravan, they're watching the end of the caravans and uh, if you take your own van out, uh, that will no doubt uh, give you, or it certainly gives me some, uh, uh, some every caravan should have one of those, that is seriously spectacular. Now, there's storage everywhere in this van, little tunnels and stuff right through it, there's your second Hanging out the uh, the drawing options. Now, four water tanks. Now, this is probably a good way of describing this van. Uh, just the stuff here. That's all pressurised systems to set uh, fill your tanks up. I have read some comments about people that uh, are not very happy with me slapping some of these caravans, but. Uh, I only slapped the ones that are designed to be slapped, Dev. Uh, this thing's seriously tough. Uh, generator box down the back. Now, we've got one, two, three, three external storage compartments. Let's, uh... uh also, nice little uh, light here. Wait for those that don't mind the beverage. Now, 24 foot van, full, and I mean full luxury in here. You just got to comprehend the quality. Is this thing is in a different league? So, uh, start with we've got a full leather dinette, trifold. Now, I did mention this is the most highly spec van we've ever had, and there's something about it that really, really sucks. I don't say we all say that about caravans, but uh, this has a ducted vacuum cleaner. Uh, Interface uh, plugs into there, switch on, and off you go. Uh, no more little broom and shovel. Again, that's uh, a first for us here. It's quite impressive. Um, now, the brains trust. 
Uh, I'm not sure there's a good way to describe that. That pretty much sums up this van. It's in a different league quality wise, absolutely spectacular. Wick. You're going to definitely forget about the bad times when you take off in the uh, full off road Burma 24 footer. Um, proper inner beds. Now, there's your full annex I, I mentioned earlier. I just cannot emphasize how this van is made. It is. Everything you touch is just solids. It's just uh, full timber trim, full leather, uh, big double door fridge. It is. Highly option, diesel heater options, uh, air conditioning, all your climate stuff there. Oh, we've got no lights on in here. The next question is, where are the switches? Lucky we are very well rehearsed here at... Uh, uh, now, i tell you one thing that you don't get to see. And uh, we see a lot of showers, but... This thing's just, it's just, you can't come and touch it. Sometimes you just don't get a gist of, of what they are. Um, oh, there it is. Uh, now, storage. That's mind-boggling. So we've got wardrobes, cupboards everywhere. Um, big Dometic front loader. Uh, full independent suspension. Spectacular, spectacular van. Uh, dual solar panels, it's the free camper's dream. Uh, series caravanners, series campers, uh, I don't think you can get a better van for this money, 39 triple nine tailway, no more to pay, uh, one owner, spectacular example, been cherished and loved its whole life, uh, come in, this is uh, uh, this is a way home away from home, remember, duct and vacuum, uh, Metro, <laughs> uh, thanks for looking, let us help you get out of town.